you know me y'all you know me i ain't gonna be wearing makeup i might be wearing makeup i ain't gonna be doing my hair i might be doing my hair but you're gonna get what you're gonna get i mean okay are you guys ready for this i needed exactly 50 dollars to finalize some business stuff and i got exactly 50 dollars <laughs> Just to put into perspective some of the other things that I have manifested, mostly for my business, I really needed cash flow to finalize the last things for establishing my YouTube and writing business. I needed to pay the person who was making my music, um, just some other back office things that required money. I'm a stay at home mom and I don't have a lot of extra money, so I literally have to manifest it because I'm not getting it through a paycheck every single two weeks. Da -da. You can see it there. $273.44. Total surprise, you guys. I got a letter in the mail stating I had somehow overpaid on a car loan that was closed out almost five years ago. This came in the mail for me. $273. I wasn't expecting it. I didn't know it was even out there for me, but I needed it. I manifested it. I said, this is how much I need to finish some projects and boom, the universe provided. Thank you. I said, okay, I need more. I need more. I have more things that I'm trying to do. I was on a ball. I needed to get going. Da -da -da! Something else. Um, I used to work in the schools as a substitute teacher and unbeknownst to me, they were putting into the para-retirement and I no longer work for them, so I got a check in the mail for, see it? Well, it's for $298.79. Yes, my darlings. This was issued on July 19th, 2018. You can see. July 19, 2018. I didn't get it until about the first week of August. So I had two checks rolling in in August. Finally, just recently, a week ago, I said, okay, the very last thing that I need, because I was procrastinating, I was doing all my project things, paying for my you know, book editing, paying for my music editing, and the money, those checks had run out. Finally, I was like, Sarah, you need to establish your business because I was starting to get paid. People were starting to pay me for my services and I needed to start showing that through my business. So I said, fine, I need $50. I need $50, that's what I need. Guess what guys? A day later, my mom calls me and she says, "Hun, I got a credit on Excel, which is our gas and electric, you know, place here in Colorado. I got an, a credit from Excel and I have an extra $50 that I would like to give you to put towards anything that you need. Anything, mom? Yeah, anything. Bills, whatever you need. And the first initial thing I wanted to say was, well, no, don't do that, mom. Pick, go do whatever you want with it. We, I don't need it, it's okay. And then the voice inside of me said, uh-uh, girl you know you need $50. And what do you need $50 for? To establish your business, the very last piece of what you need to do. I said, mom, actually, I need the $50 to establish my business. Is that okay? Absolutely, no problem. I'll write you a check tomorrow. That's how the universe works. When you fill it, you put it out there, you do the mental, emotional work, right? Because I was manifesting it in a way that I felt it was already there. I was writing it down exactly what I needed, what I needed it for, how it's going to help me, how it's going to change. And I said, I need it in the next two months, period. I need it in the next two months. And the universe said, okay, we're going to get that to you. And it worked its magic and poof, I got what I needed you guys. And that's how beautiful manifestation is. You don't know what's happening on the other side. You have no idea. An angel, like seriously, an angel on earth, my mother, 
but she's the type of person that listens to her intuition. If she feels something that she needs to do, she says it's, you know, God speaking to her heart, she does it. She doesn't ask questions, she just, she just does it. I came into her mind that day that she got the credit and she said, I'm gonna bless my daughter with $50. She didn't know why, she didn't know why it needed to be $50. She could have said 20, 30, 40, 10, nothing. She said $50. $50. Think about that. Just let that magic resonate in you. Let that divine magic resonate in you. $50. I needed it. She felt the urge, right? The divine power in her heart was placed in her. She didn't question it. She did it. I didn't question it because I knew the universe always provides for me. God always provides. You would just say it's luck and I'd say no. It's my manifestation, faith, ability to manifest, faith, faith, faith in God. So yeah, I thought this would be a very fitting video to start off Manifest Monday. And you can expect a lot more of these type of videos on Monday. Kind of what I do to manifest what I'm wanting, needing, working on. So you'll see a lot of, you know, projects that I do, daily things that I do, the intentions that I set, um, just great exercise to get you in the rhythm. It's taken me probably, oh goodness, I would say I really started learning the power of manifestation in 2010. So do the math, y'all. It's 2018. It's taken me that long to really understand the power and to really get in the groove of doing the necessary steps. And it works. And it's beautiful. And it's awesome. And I deserve it. And you deserve it. So follow me every Monday. And you can start doing the same things. Maybe put a spin on it, share below what works for you, what doesn't work for you, share your stories. So yes, this is just my Monday morning wake up manifestation and there'll be so much more to come. If I feel it, if it calls me, I sit down, turn the camera on, start recording. I try to look a little presentable. I'm not gonna look all cray cray. But the one thing you're always gonna get with me is authenticity and just the ability to be true and transparent because I wanna help you. I've been through so much and I've had to kind of fumble and stumble along the way, figure things out. And if I can share what's helped me so that when you come across a trying time, it can help you, then that's my goal. That's my goal. So peace, love, and happiness. And I Next Monday, we will look at my vision board and DIY how-to.